Hi island luxury lovers! Every part of the world has stunning islands to explore which grow in popularity as tourist destinations every year. And today in this video we will talk all about an island which has majestic Python mountains, drive-in volcano, refreshing waterfalls, spectacular hiking trails, beautiful beaches, local street parties, and exclusive restaurants. Do you have an idea of which island we're talking about? Yes, my island luxury lovers, today we will talk all about St. Lucia Island. St. Lucia is arguably the most beautiful of all Caribbean islands. With its spectacular landscape, lush rainforest, beautiful beaches, and the stunning Caribbean Sea, St. Lucia is undoubtedly one of the Caribbean's most distinctive and beautiful islands. It's the perfect winter sun destination that you guys have been dreaming for. St. Lucia is part of the Windward Islands of the Lesser Antilles, a long arc of islands on the edge of the Caribbean Sea and is blessed with the cooling trade winds in the winter months. There are two airports here, Hewanora International and the regional airport, George Charles. This beautiful island is only four hours away from New York or Toronto and eight hours from London. In a league of its own, the island's unmatched splendor is in due part to its volcanic origin. Rich in minerals, the soil produces vegetation so lush that the island seems more like a painted masterpiece. There are two sides of St. Lucia. The south is the mountainous, more rugged region that is perfect for a couple's retreat, while the north is filled with all-inclusive resorts, nightlife, and beaches that are perfect for the whole family. Believe me, this island will offer you some truly rewarding moments. St. Lucia delivers an experience that is truly special. The two statuesque volcanic mountains known as Gros Python and Petit Python are the crown jewels of the island, creating one of the most beautiful scenes in the Caribbean. There is no doubt that these are the top tourist attractions in St. Lucia. It is these landmarks that make the island so attractive. If you're feeling like pulling yourself away from your luxury resort, a hike up the Gros Python Trail will certainly get your heart pounding. This UNESCO World Heritage Site is the iconic symbol of St. Lucia Island. St. Lucia is also a top-ranking dive destination, where over 150 different species of fishes can be found. Both photographers and dive lovers are in store of an exciting experience on the island, where divers can explore marine parks, reefs, shipwrecks, and so much more. Diving in St. Lucia offers a world-class experience, with the island ideally situated between the Caribbean Sea and the Atlantic Ocean. This ancient volcanic activity that gave birth to this emerald green jewel of an island also shaped its dramatic underwater seascape. It's easy to see why St. Lucia was ranked in the top 10 for best wreck diving when you explore the Leslie M a 165-foot former freighter that is now beautifully encrusted with the corals and perfect for all skill levels of divers. The Leslie M is a magnet for marine life, including swirling schools of yellowtail snapper. You can explore in and all around the ship's wide-open cargo hold, which has enough natural light to make it safe for even beginner divers. The average scuba diving price starts from $280 and goes up to $630. St. Lucia is the beauty queen of the Caribbean. Marigot Bay is arguably the most beautiful bay on St. Lucia. It's best viewed from a vista point on the road between the main Caribbean coastal route and the bay itself. Lush hillsides plunge into the pretty palm fringe beach and yachts bob on the bay's blue waters. If you want to rent a boat and take a tour of some of the blue crystal clear waters, it'll cost you around $115 per day. But if you want luxurious accommodation and want to experience some rewarding moments with your couple or family, you may rent a yacht for around $375 per day in St. Lucia Island. Thanks to the island's dramatic topography, hiking in St. Lucia can be especially rewarding. And the Tet Paul Nature Trail offers some of the most spectacular views in Southern St. Lucia. Along the gentle trail, you can learn about medicinal plants and trees, sample exotic tropical fruits, and discover the traditional Amerindian art of cassava production. You'll see plenty of pineapples growing along the way as well.
St. Lucia is a popular tourism site due to its tropical weather and scenery and for its large beaches and resorts. The best time to travel to St. Lucia if you're hoping to avoid crowds is from March till April or from October to November. No matter when you go in the Caribbean, the beaches are bound to be beautiful. St. Lucia offers some gorgeous beaches with stunning views. Jalousie Beach. Imagine an afternoon baking in the sun while admiring the views of stunning Twin Peaks. This beach is the place to make that happen. Jalousie Beach looks and feels incredibly green, but it's also known for its powdery white sand and its quintessential Caribbean blue waters. Grade Anze Beach. Yes, yes, most people head to the beach for its salt water and sand, but this east side beach also has turtles, lots of turtles. And not just any turtles either. These are endangered leatherback turtles, aka the largest of all sea turtles. During the nesting season, travelers come to watch them crawl out of the water and lay their eggs. If you are not a turtle lover, don't worry my island luxury lovers, this beach is stunning and offers breathtaking views and such a peaceful atmosphere. Did you know island luxury lovers, a veteran visitor, celebrity Oprah Winfrey, lists St. Lucia as one of the top five places to see in one's lifetime. It's also rumored that Oprah owns real estate in St. Lucia. Also, the celebrity star Matt Damon reportedly rented out the entire hotel for a weekend of festivities, which cost him around a million dollars, according to Life & Style magazine. It's said that many big names were invited, including George Clooney, Ben Affleck, Jimmy Kimmel, Stanley Tucci, Michael Douglas, and Catherine Zeta-Jones, along with Brad Pitt and Angelina Jolie. They decided to renew their wedding vows after eight years of marriage at the Sugar Beach Resort in St. Lucia. And trust me, there are many other celebrities who have visited this island several times for the vacations and trips and keep visiting St. Lucia Island. If you're thinking about where to stay in St. Lucia, here are some of the best and top rated luxury resorts, hotels, and villas that will offer you a once in a lifetime experience on St. Lucia Island. But before we tell you, a quick reminder to subscribe to our YouTube channel for more island luxury videos. It means a lot to us. Sugar Beach is set amidst more than 100 acres of tropical rainforest on the island's scenic Caribbean coast. Embraced by St. Lucia's majestic World Heritage listed pythons, the resort's 96 luxury sugar mill rooms, cottages, villas, and luxury beachfront bungalows boast elegant styling, private plunge pool, four poster bed, luxurious Egyptian cotton linens, every possible modern amenity, and personalized butler service. Two stunning white sand beaches, a beautiful rainforest spa with treehouse treatment rooms, a full paddy dive facility, and superb waterfront dining ensure the ultimate vacation experience with space enough for honeymooners and families alike. How luxurious is this hotel, my island luxury lovers? The price to stay in this hotel starts from $1,400 and goes up to $3,000 per night. Villa Hall This luxurious villa is located in the idyllic Cap Estates. Villa Hall is a magnificent St. Lucia vacation home that offers guests an unparalleled sense of luxury for their next Caribbean getaway. With notes of grandeur found in every corner of this stately home, guests will enjoy a luxury vacation worth remembering for a lifetime. You can rent this entire villa for more than $1,789 per night, where only more than 12 guests are able to enjoy the luxurious and accommodations it provides. If you're worrying about your budget, St. Lucia also offers some budget hotels and resorts. The Downtown Hotel The downtown is located in Soufriere, connected to a shopping center. It's at a convenient location. The beach is only a five-minute walk, restaurants and shops are within a walking distance, and you can stay here for only $66 a night. Let's share a few extra details before ending off this video. The average price of a seven-day trip to St. Lucia is $1,971 for a solo traveler, $3,480 for a couple, and $6,600 for a family. The flights are the most expensive part of the trip most of the time. Well, that's it for today's video. I hope you all fell in love with the luxurious and nature bounties of this island because <laughs> I did. Unfortunately, we're ending this video, but don't worry, we will show you more another time. Make sure you hit the like and subscribe button, 
put the notifications on so you'll be the first seeing new videos. And please let me know in the comments what you liked most about St. Lucia Island and which island you would like to see next. Follow us on Instagram at IslandLuxuryYT for daily luxury islands posts and a few seconds of a distraction at your work or whenever you need a little break. That was it for today, Island Luxury Lovers. Thank you for watching, and I will see you next time.